Here we go. Margaret Sanger, the founder of Planned Parenthood, was an avowed racist whose goal was to reduce the black population in America, and she succeeded. 80% of abortion clinics in America are in minority neighborhoods. Over 22,500,000 black babies have been aborted in 50 years. Over 1,000 black babies are aborted every, every day. day. Abortion is the number one killer of black lives in the United States, according to the Centers for Disease Control CDC. and Prevention. Abortion kills more black people than HIV, homicide, diabetes, accidents, cancer, and heart disease combined. combined. What was the objective of Planned Parenthood? Now you're talking about in the 30s now. Right. You're talking about someone by the name of Margaret Sanger, who was the founder of Planned Parenthood. What did she say the purpose was? Margaret Sanger, who was an honorary Klan's woman, Margaret Sanger, who used to give lectures at Klan's rallies talking about the population of Negroes and particularly has to be lessened. Margaret Sanger, who said that, quote, Negroes are like human weeds and should be exterminated, end quote. Margaret Sanger, who in a black and white interview that everyone can go look up on YouTube right now with Mike Wallace, sat there and said that I believe, quote, I believe that bringing a child, I believe the greatest sin is to bring a child into the world, end quote. You can go watch that on YouTube right now. Pause the video, go look at it, come back. Do you believe in sin? When I say believe, I don't mean in believe in committing sin. Do you believe there is such a thing as, a, as sin? I think the greatest sin in the world is bringing children into the world that have disease from their parents, that have no chance in the world to be a human being, practically. Delinquents, prisoners, all sorts of things just mark when they're born. That, to me, is the greatest sin. When you realize that your overall existence as a human reality is coming to an end collectively, you are going to make some moves. So what people don't realize is, <clears throat> as Dr. Frances Cress Welsing said in her book titled The ISIS Papers, and this is something she debated people on all over this country and all over the world, and she never lost the debate. You're dealing with the war of genetic annihilation, why people are dying faster than they are being born. And this is according to the United States Census Bureau. They have determined that by the year 2042, white people will be the minority in America. They're currently the majority. In neighborhoods that are of a more upscale, financially affluent society, white, Jewish, etc., they are infused with fertility clinics. While in our societies, the ones that do not have that elevated level of economics, black and brown, impoverished communities have abortion clinics. Right. Right. Like another Clinton. Right. 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 That hawk right. who praised Margaret Sanger. Right. Who was a eugenicist? Right. That's right. Who right. loved the idea right. of destroying and eradicating black life? Yes, she, and then it transferred from her mind into her organization. Mm -hmm. It was first called the American Birth Control League. Mm -hmm.